I'd like to show you an amazing tool that'll help you use the Common Core Standards more effectively. It's called a Big Book, for obvious reasons. It's really big. Let me take you on a tour of this tool and show you some of its features. The first part of the book has smaller versions of our classroom posters. They make it easy to see all the standards for any grade level on just one page. Next comes the Where's It Found part. Here you'll find every important word from all the Common Core standards. For each word, you'll find what standard or standards it is found in. You might ask why this is helpful. It's a great question. Let me show you how it works. You can take a specific concept like indexes. When should this concept be taught? We can go to page 33 and find the word indexes. We learn that its only mention is in the second grade's Reading for Information Standard 5. That's good information for second grade teachers, but it's also important for third, fourth, and fifth grade teachers. Since the word indexes is only in the second grade, that means that test writers can test that concept in any grade from second grade on. Third grade teachers, that means that your students can be tested on indexes without them appearing anywhere in your grade level standards. Mysteries, only mentioned in fifth grade. Mythology, fourth and seventh. Menus, first and second. Where's It Found can also give you a picture of what's important in the Common Core State Standards. Let's take a look at page 28 and the word evidence. This is like a graph that shows that the idea of evidence starts in third grade and then is built on in every subsequent grade. Although there are only three standards in fourth and fifth grade that refer to evidence, it's clear that it's a concept that becomes very important in upper grades. You'll find that the Big Book will become one of the most important tools in bringing the Common Core Standards to your classroom. Ordering information for both the Language Arts and Mathematics Big Books is available at standards-toolbox.org.